brain. This week marks the 10 year anniversary of a severe storm that hit Tucson. The storm was one of the worst the Sabino Canyon area has experienced. Five consecutive nights of heavy rain caused flash flooding in July 2006. Water damaged homes. Many lost precious belongings and cars were submerged in mud. Not in your sides. Priscilla Casper joins us live at the 49er Country Club with the recovery. Guys, Stella, I'm in the Tanky Verde Wash, located within the Country Club. Now, as you can see, pretty dry conditions, very windy, um, but there are a couple puddles that happened from last night. However, 10 years ago, this entire wash was engulfed in mud. It was running, I mean, it was running real, it was, I mean, making, you know, making waves. Wendy Cross remembers exactly when this storm hit. It was running hard. It was deep and fast and, and a massive amount of water all at one time. Water by the gallons rammed through homes, destroyed precious belongings, and as Cross shows us in these photos, submerged parts of the golf course. She gave me a tour of the Tanque Verde wash, reminiscing on the aftermath. Oh, it was bank to bank. It was, uh... It was really quite an amazing amount of water coming through here. Nearly 40 homes and businesses flooded, 100 vehicles submerged in water. Destroyed. It's destroyed. It was just coming like a river. A part of our driveway is gone. The flooding prompted a federal disaster declaration in five counties, including here in Pima County. The total cost of the damage? $13.6 million. Cross says if this storm hits again, she will be ready. We're prepared for it mentally. Um, we're prepared <laughs> for it physically from a, of what we need to do, what equipment we need. Um, we have a lot more equipment on hand now than we did 10 years ago. Cross says it took about a week to get rid of all of this mud in this area, but she did tell me that today this is the best the golf course has ever looked. Reporting live at the 49ers Country Club, Priscilla Casper, KGA 9 on your side. Priscilla, thank you. By the looks of it, it looks like the east side is getting hit with a storm right now. So if